Welcome to today's quick tip on transition delays in the Comprehensive Program Web App. When a class member is identified as proceeding towards transition and they encounter an issue or concern that is significantly causing a delay in the transition pattern, you can enter a transition delay. To do this, you go to the transition pre-transition form transition delay and submit a transition delay. Select the reason of the delay, for example, behavioral health status, enter the date you are entering the, um, entering the hold, and then enter a description of the issue. Um, let's pretend this class member was hospitalized for psychosis. I'm going to submit that delay. My submission was successful. And then I can, if I go back out to my class members page, our friend Iggy is now in pre-transition hold phase, which in indicates that there is an active transition delay for that class member. If I wish to resolve that delay, I can go back into my transition delay. I can view the transition delays that have been entered for that class member, and then I can add an outcome. I'm also able um, to edit the status or correct any issues that may have encountered when I entered that original transition delay date. The outcomes for this class member are provided here, and then a resolution date. As a reminder, to proceed to CAST at this point, you need to have a transition delay on file before you can do so. Proceeding to CAST is a result of a transition delay. Transition delays are not to be more than 90 days per comprehensive program policies. If you do need to extend a transition delay beyond that, please contact your clinical support team at UIC College of Nursing. In this situation, I'm saying the outcome is proceed to CAST. I'm hitting update, and then from there, I can submit my CAST request and provide the additional details in order to process that request. Once I enter this information, I hit submit, and it gets sent to my UIC clinical team for their review. As noticed previously, you are able to edit any issues that need to be fixed here. Let's say I entered the wrong date of the delay, or I entered uh, some, I have additional information regarding the delay and I'm able to extend the box here if I need more information.